Yo, what's going on, guys? Owen from Division 1 Esports here, and today I'm doing a little voiceover. I went 142 and 4, I believe, in this game. Uh, uh, Nuketown Dom, super fun. There's so many bad players in this playlist just because it's the first one. So when people hop right into the game, it's like the automatically selected, which is super fun. I've been uh, playing a ton of it in Nuketown 24 7, but. So I thought I'd make this video um, to show you guys like a few updates, um, what's happening, uh, what, I, what I've been doing. Um, hopefully you guys did enjoy my last video. I know, uh, I think I took like a week. I didn't make any videos for like a week. Just because, um, now that I have the editor, I have the editing situation, you know, figured out. We have an editor right now for Division 1 Esports. One full time. Um, and then we're picking up another editor soon. Um, I think he said he's getting a new computer or something. I don't remember. But, um, we have one for sure. He's editing the new video actually right now. And then... Once that happens, I'm gonna have to, I'm not gonna have to edit any more videos, which is gonna be awesome because that's why I spend a lot of my time either editing the videos, um, and then making the thumbnails. Which just thumbnails don't take that much time, um, but a lot of my time is spent editing. So having that out of the way gives me a lot more time. Uh, I've been working on the website a lot now because that has a lot of work to be done, um, especially with a few logistics in terms of the profile building and uh, what we're trying to do on there with the services and stuff. So. Yeah, that's where I've been at for updating that. The apparel is super, like, figured out. Um, I'm actually going to be asking the guys today. Um, we're going to be putting the orders in. So, then I'm going to, once we put the orders in for that, I'm going to open up the store on the actual website. I just want to get, like, a full order in and make sure everything's, like, perfect. Um, just for myself, um, the members within the team, everything like that. Then we'll open up the store online and, uh, you know, have it open forever. Um... Right now, I have the sweatshirts and the jerseys. Um, I don't have the t-shirt and the long sleeve, so that's also another thing. Uh, I didn't open the store yet because of that. Hopefully, we're going to get some flags. Um, like, you can see this optic flag behind me. Hopefully, going to be getting some flags like that. So, I don't think they're that much to make or, like, at all. So, I just got to find the, the right company to get it from. But, yeah. So, we got the apparel done. Let's see. Hopefully, like I said before, hopefully you guys enjoyed my last video, the speed art. I was thinking about doing instead of vlogging because... I did record on like two more vlogs, but they're really fucking boring. Like, I was just basically in my room like the whole time. Uh, Cause one weekend it was like super icy. I couldn't do anything. My parents wouldn't let me do anything. And then like I don't know. So I'll definitely vlog if I do something really entertaining. Like I do something cool, like go to the city or something. Um, like go to Boston or if I go to New York, if I go do something, I'll vlog it. But as of now, I was thinking about doing like a speed of the week. So basically, like record everything I'm doing, like editing. Um, if I'm editing um, on Photoshop, whatever I'm making, uh, the website designing, I don't know, like, anything like that, I was going to record it and then, you know, do, like, a speed of it, like, times 50, like I did with the speed art. I think it'd be really cool. I personally fucking love watching speed arts. Like, I, I literally watched mine, like, a few times just because I think they're so sick. Um, but hopefully I can do more speed arts like that because it, it's really easy to make, and I think it actually is pretty cool. But... Yeah, so if you guys want any of that or you yeah, have any opinion on, you know, if I should do that or not, let me know in the comments below. But I'm making this video really quick, like I said, to update you guys on um, what's going on. So um, we did pick up, we have a team for NGE League. If you don't know what NGE League is, it's a Call of Duty League, $2,000 prize pool. Um, it could be a little more. I don't, I believe it's $2,000. Um, the qualifier is this Friday and Saturday. So that's going to be super hype. Um, hopefully going to be streaming that on the Visual Esports Twitch Unfortunately, I cannot go in game. Um, my plan was to go in game on like our team and just be not alive, so I could spectate the guys and and like stream it. I'm not gonna be able to do that. So, what I think I'm gonna do is either share play or just like stream somebody's POV. Um, I don't really know what I'm gonna do yet. Either gonna stream someone's POV or just like. Cause I think like a few of my friends are coming over Friday, so we might just like stream and like like four of us in here like, um, we're probably gonna be playing some blackout or something, and then stream the qualifier. Um, I don't know, but it's gonna be dope. We got we had a team. Um, Gwen is the captain of the team. We had a team, and then um, they weren't really performing well. We picked up Natural, who I'm sure you guys know Natural. He's a beast. Um, cause he wasn't actually able to play, um, when we asked him the first time, but he's able to play now. We picked up Natural. Amp. Um, yes, yeah, so we picked up Natural um, as well as we still have Gwen on the team. He's still the captain. We picked up Amp, 
Um, and then we also picked up Farm, and we also picked up Miles. So that's going to be the squad uh, going into the qualifier. Super, super solid squad. Um, really happy that we got this together, and uh, hopefully should be good. Every match, if we do qualify for the league, will be streamed on the NGE Twitch. So I'll definitely be tweeting that out. Um, they have casters and everything like that, so it's going to be super legit. Um, it's going to be super entertaining for you guys, and then we get some good content out of that. Um, which is gonna be super awesome. Maybe some we're gonna definitely get to some highlights. Uh, you know, with casters, I feel like it'd be awesome to put something like that up. Um, you know, somebody talking over the gameplay that actually, you know, is good at talking, uh, unlike me. But yes, yeah, so that's gonna be super awesome. And uh, another awesome thing that we have going on is the website. We are gonna be, you know, remaking the website. Not not entirely, but. Uh, I made the website originally before like starting the YouTube and the Twitch and the Insta before starting anything I just made the website It was rough, but it had all the things that I wanted It just doesn't look up to par if you if you kind of understand where I'm going like there's a lot of people out there that are Yeah, making great looking websites, but for us It's difficult because of what we're doing where you can if you don't know about like a profile system um, Definitely go in the description. It'll be down below or go to the website division when esports.com forward slash or um, to join the division uh, Go on there You can make a profile it helps you get sponsored. That's the gist of like our services and what we're gonna provide um, so Because of all of that it has to be like, you know, obviously customizable. I can't use something that's really really easy to make so Troubleshooting a ton on that is um, where I spend a lot of my time just because I, I personally I can build websites But I'm not at all like an HTML like I can't program a full website in HTML or CSS if you understand what like what that is. Or, like I'm good, but I'm not great. Okay, so troubleshooting definitely takes up a lot of my time, and which is why I'm gonna be trying super super hard to get that website looking perfect and uh, everything like that. So that's gonna be awesome. Uh, the content as of now uh, is going to probably stay the same two videos a week on the Division One Esports YouTube channel. And then um, if you're not following us on Twitter or Instagram, I highly recommend it. We post twice a day, usually like a clip a day. Um, something video form is going up there, uh, which is super awesome. But yeah, uh, that's basically where I'm at. I don't know how long this video has been. But uh, yeah, I think I'm going to... I got a few things in the works right now, um, aside from Division One Esports. Thinking about getting in... Um, you, if you saw my vlog, like, obviously, you know, I play lacrosse, or, like, everyone knows, most people that know me know I play lacrosse, but thinking about doing some lacrosse, like, um, sports edits, as in terms of, like, pictures, because, um, I'll put a few up on the screen, I made them a long time ago, so I'm, like, I've, I've gotten a lot better, like, at Photoshop, everything like that, so I can definitely make a bunch of those for, like, really cheap, and then editing people's highlight reels, um, just as a side hustle to pour all the money back into Division 1 Esports. I'm um, thinking about doing a few other things. Like I said, I can design websites um, as long as they're, you know, our, going back to it, our Division 1 Esports website has a lot going on with it. It's, it's super unique in terms of, like, all the profile and, like, the social interaction between profiles that I have to figure out. But um, I'm thinking about building websites for other teams. Hopefully, that's super easy. So, got a few side hustles going into the works. I'm trying to make, a, like... Uh, some some apparel for lacrosse, which we've got a lot of really sick ideas for apparel for lacrosse um, You know lacrosse players stuff like that pennies everything like that um, So I got a lot of things in the works um, And I'll probably hopefully be sharing it on here It's like I said difficult for me to make videos right now on this channel when I have to edit but now that we have an editor um, And then we might be even getting two editors. I have to see um, I have to hit that guy back up But yeah, so hopefully you guys did enjoy this video um, the game is about to end right here. And, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you have any uh, questions or ideas about anything, let me know in the comments below. And uh, follow Division 1 Esports on Twitter. Go to the website, check it out. Let me know what you think. And, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.
Zero limit. Our point located. Our point locked down. Never a doubt. Good job.